There are very few full-time gunsmiths on Delmarva. The trade of gunsmithing is not alive and well. Oh, it's completely dying. Most gunsmiths at this point make less than electricians, so people see more money in being an electrician than they do a gunsmith. You have to really like to do it in order to do it. Mike Dellinger of Dagsboro is one of the last of this dying breed, maybe even the best of the last. Not many carry the prestigious title world-class gunsmith. A lofty moniker he began earning some 20 years ago. I took a gun to a person one time that worked on it and uh, didn't do a very good job. So I decided to do it myself and completely ruined it. <laughs> I, I destroyed the gun. So I salvaged what I could and I started over again. And I just continued to roll from there. Today, the passage of time has burnished Mike's gunsmithing achievements into legend. He is internationally known. He does it all. He makes them, repairs them, and sells them. Repairs are bread and butter. Uh, there are a lot of them out there that, uh, you know, people want to have fixed because they can't afford to get a new one. He also has a specialty. Goat mounting is one of my specialties. <laughs> I, have, uh, I have a tool on the market, as a matter of fact, that is manufactured by Brownells with my name on it. As for making custom guns... I have the capability to build them from scratch, but it's kind of, it's cost prohibitive for people to uh, pay me to build it absolutely from scratch. What price range do your custom guns run? Strip down models run from 850 and top of the line can run to 16,000. What do you hunt with a $16,000 rifle? Anything you want to. 